things. In my opinion, your episodes sounded the most like Larry David. Uh, it, it's almost like I, I would have thought he wrote some of them. If, you know, I didn't, wasn't such a deep fan of the show and knew that you wrote them. But I'm just saying, like, the way you wrote George, um, you know, some of the lines you came up with, like, I'm living 20 lies, and my whole life is a sham. You know, just you really captured George. And, and we were just talking about before you came on, just, the, you know, the Hamptons, George, obviously. But just did, did you write for Larry? because you knew his sense of humor? Or did you share his sense of humor? Was it like intentional? Because it just seems like of all the all those writers on the show, yours, you know, connected with Larry David's uh, humor the most, I, in my opinion. I, I agree with you definitely on the on the story front, you know, Larry loved doing small slice of life stories, tiny little things that would blow up. And that's where I wanted to always be. You know, like I wasn't, you know, into having, you know, Kramer driving a bus or, you know, things like that. You know, that that's just not the kind of stuff that I would even think about. You know, there were other writers who, who did. You know, but I, I was um, always kind of wedded to Larry's original you know, concept of the show, you know, that just these tiny little stories. So, um, you know, and as far as, you know, dialogue and, and funny lines, you know, I think I do, I did share like Larry's um, sensibility in that way. You know, like every, every time I'd read one of Larry's scripts, I'd go up to him and he'd go, your favorite line you're about to tell me? <laughs> and I and I just tell him, and he goes, "Yeah, I would have guessed that was the one." You would. Do you have any of those that you could think of that were your favorite lines of his? Or you know, there was one really early, early on that I just absolutely loved, where George says, I "I've never really had an appointment where I wanted the other person to show up." <laughs> yeah, that's one of my favorites. I use it all the time. One of the greatest lines in the history of TV. Agreed, agreed. I think I probably have that thought once a week. <laughs> we had that thought right now. We wanted to talk to you. We were I know, I know. <laughs> Anytime something's canceled, I'm happy. <laughs> <laughs> so